And hello guys and welcome to my uh, Castlevania Bloodlines playthrough and this is stage 3 with Eric Morris. No, it's not Eric Morris, John Morris his name is. Ah, uh, I've always uh, yeah, make their names. Ah, uh, there we go. Um I just played the stage with Lecard so I know what's coming for me. So if you want to see me play it blind, please watch that part. But now I'm not playing blind, now I'm just playing for survival, man! Just trying to survive as best as I can, because uh, with uh, Lecard I just lost a uh, continue. And uh, that was my last, so with this uh, John Morris I will try not to lose at all. Hopefully we will succeed, but time will tell, my friends, time will tell. These, uh, goddamn... ...are some harsh enemies. When they are up in the air. Because they are always intruding on my personal space. We have already lost half of our health, and we did the same mistake as I did with the card. But uh, really, we just should just run here and hope for the best. And uh, the eye actually does not poke me or anything, it just follows me silently, judgingly. Uh, with this guy, I wonder... Oh, there's a down path too. We With uh, Le Car we went up, actually. Because we saw we could do that. And uh, I guess I can do it with... Maybe I can't do it with John Morris, actually. I, I thought I would. I would. But no. Uh, seems like we are forced to go this way. So let's just do it. I'm totally another path than uh, Le Card. And uh, yeah, need to swing, I guess. Can be good. And do not get hit by the whip. <laughs> Damn. Alright. Let's move into the fray. With the mini whip. <laughs> I hate the mini. Ah, oh, god damn it, they damage a hell of a lot, these guys. And they are not giving me any rest. So just let me go through. Thank you. <sighs> so we'll swing like a boss. Then we will just punish him for existing and uh, we will not drop down and die for those small jewels. So this part is actually blind, so I didn't know there would come part that actually was blind in this game. But now we seem to be uh, right where we were with the other guy. So can I do this with this? Yeah, this attack was really effective against this boss. Uh, if I could just do it some more, but uh, I guess I ran out of options, so now I just need to punch him. And there we go. That was nice touch. And there. Actually, quite simple movement pattern, but he still hits me. <laughs> How annoying isn't that? And now the falling tower. Yes, this tower actually drained a lot of health with uh, Le Card, but I hope we will drain less this time. This time I actually took the mirror too, but it was nothing, I guess. Just trying to avoid all those Medusa heads, and at the same time taking all the upgrades on the way here. Ah, by p punching the candles while standing on them. Because if you stand at the side of them, you will just see them drop. Because uh, that's the thing this game actually misses. It's the... Uh, it doesn't miss it, but uh, when the tower is moving like this, the power-up is falling through the floor. While it, it, in my opinion, should actually just not do that. But maybe I'm just uh, sad, so... Uh... Ah, damn it. Don't I uh, continue here, you two. That would be bad. We we're supposed to be better when playing this the second time around, but I'm just moving through my normal patterns, you know. Well, we actually killed that guy at the first try and not died at him at l uh, as I did last time. I was going to try. Yeah, just thinking about it got me hurt, so uh, I'm not going to try for that candle. Dodge. Get that back before he gets you. No, it's incredible sometimes how stupid you can be and get hit by the most ridiculous thing, ridiculous things. 
But then we have these enemies, and seriously, with Morris, it's a little bit harder because I cannot punch uh, straight up in the air. I can do the jump though, but uh, that's not just as effective. So we have to do all the air stage without dying, like I did with the card. But then again, what's the fun in that? No, just kidding. Of course you shall. Now the question is how, not. I just hope we will get a whip upgrade here. There, thank you. Because without it, it would be really, really not fun to do the this place, place. And if you just jump as fast as you can, maybe we can get him on the rerun. He will stop there and then come straight at me. So that's about it. Oh yeah, come straight from top. Thank you. My God. And then we have the falling ones that we just have to go upwards in. And these guys are a little bit more dangerous now. When they are... Damn it. But they are actually giving me power-ups, which can be good if I face the boss, but uh, I don't have the correct weapon, so to speak. Ah, oh, no, don't damn it, damn it. There we go. Oh, he actually gave me holy water. There we go. Thought I almost would miss it, but you just need to be patient. Not a patient, but ah, oh, damn it! Oh no! Fucking hell! You're kidding me, right? No. <laughs> And I'll also continue with John Morris as well. So now we have no continues on both the characters. This is not my lucky day. Then again, Friday wasn't my lucky day either, but that's uh, because it's a uh, unlucky day for everyone, I guess. There we go. And... Ah, god damn it, he got me. This time I got him, and... What the hell is this? Oh, it's the boomerang. Yeah, the boomerang may be an ex excellent choice for the boss, actually. So we're trying, we'll try to keep that one. Hopefully. There we go. Just go up. The boomerang will be nice here, because then I can just kill these guys if I have to really fast. Almost got him. But no. Ah, oh, there I got him. No! The fuck this game! I swear to God, I'm so unlucky. No! Ah, oh, damn it. I don't want to play the game from the beginning again. I need to be awesome. Although it doesn't do, it do, do anything. The only thing that uh, will get better if I play it from the beginning is the score. And actually, I will probably have more continuous than I had last time. Let's see here. Will we go get the boomerang maybe, perhaps? It would be a good thing to have. Also, I just think in my own dirty little mind. Getting the bat there, and then jumping up here. And for the love of God, don't fall down. <clears throat> Come on, Morris. The card had it easier than this. Of course he had this. Goddamn spear, he can, he can fucking... Oh, you were really close. And... The falling part, again. This time, don't die. That's about... Oh yeah, that's how you kill monsters. Need to time it well. Oh no, there we lost it, and by it I mean uh, the boomerang, it would have been awesome to have at the boss, but life is just not that simple. Oh, it didn't kill me this time, but it surely did damage me. There we go. And then stay, and he'll come straight at you, and you take the C. Oh yes, just run. Oh, it's boss time. 
No, it's just was not that. Uh, yeah, yeah, that's true. We have. Ah, yeah, the axe. Might as well. Okay, this time, guys, we'll, let's try to kill him at the first try and not fall down like I did with the car. That would be nice. Uh, take. Take the axe. Or so I thought you would do. But you had other plans. Okay. I uh, don't get hit like that. Okay. So far, so good. Let's hopefully get this a little bit better this time. Ah. Uh, oh, you almost hit me. And he actually hit me. I got damn hate those. Another spin. Okay, let's do this. You and me, baby. Oh no, he's jumping. Exactly like Ripley or Yeah! Thank god we made it. And that awful scream. <laughs> oh yeah. Tower completed with John Morris too. Yeah, but jumping off the cliff and die but god damn it Morris. <laughs> I'm tired of your shit. <laughs> Oh, thank god. We, we made it, guys, with both of the characters, and uh, no continues left on any of them, and uh, with Morris we have actually one less life. Hopefully next time we will make the stage without even getting hurt, but uh, seeming how difficult this game is, I highly doubt it. <laughs> Look forward to my death next time, guys. See you later.